Just like Little Italy, the all-new 2018 Alfa Romeo Stelvio is the ultimate expression of Italian craftsmanship. And today I'm joined by Ben from Alfa Romeo, who's going to give me the scoop on the Stelvio, while I give him a little history of some classic Italian restaurants. Thanks for joining me, Ben. Thanks for having me, Brittany. Just like so many old Italian family recipes, Alfa Romeo has actually been around since the early 1900s. Even our badge has a lot of history behind it. You'll notice the crown? Well, that speaks to our racing heritage. We've actually been winning races for over 100 years now. And like Alfa Romeo, our first spot, Scafuri Bakery, has also been around since the early 1900s. Luigi Scafuri started the bakery back in 1904, and although the same recipes are around, the interiors had some significant upgrades. Well, the same can be said for the Stelvio. On the inside, you're going to find standard premium leather seating surfaces, aluminum trim if you want that sporty look, or if you want a bit more of an upscale look, you can get real wood. We have a flat bottom steering wheel and large display screens as well. Well, while the Stelvio's appearance is beautiful, safety is also of the utmost importance. It sure is. Why don't we hop in, I'll show you some of the features. Protecting drivers and passengers is our number one goal. And to ensure everyone's safety, Stelvio offers a host of standard and available safety and security features. Eight standard airbags, forward collision warning, adaptive cruise control with full stop and go, and a rear backup camera with parking sensors. And just behind us, Conte di Savoy has been open since 1948. Since then, they've been importing Italian meats, cheeses, and wines straight from Italy. Speaking of Italy, the Stelvio is actually designed and built there. Its turbocharged engine is tuned for performance with 280 horsepower and a best-in-class 0-60 to 60 time of 5.4 seconds. That is super fast, and just about as much time as I need to take down a chicken Vesuvio, which is rumored to have been first baked at the Rosebud right here in Taylor. How about we head over and grab some food? Yeah, let's check it out. Sounds good. 